10,000 real followers in 90 days on Instagram. Let's chat about it. Shareable content, Instagram stories, and consistency. We'll be talking about all three. Get ready. First off, I'm feeling on Instagram, especially with the launch of Reels uh, this last year. I'm just feeling some pre-2016 vibes on Instagram when it was a lot easier to grow. There's never been a time in the last couple years where it's been a lot easier to grow on Instagram. And obviously, they got Tiki Talk, TikTok to pretty much compete with. So here they are coming out with the reels and allowing the same type of virality, searchability, exposure onto the Instagram platform. And you know what's great? They pay more. For an account that is growing from 10,000 range to 20,000 range, in the month of December 2021, I reached 345,000 accounts. Next month, I did about the same, around at 300,000 again of January 2022. And again, this isn't a big personality brand. It's something I've grown organically. I'll probably do a video on how much I got paid with the amount of reach I got in the last 60 days, going into 90 days and how I'm growing my account. But I wanna just talk, talk to you guys, it's timing. Timing right now, this is a time in history where we need to take advantage of attention. Obviously, one of the largest and biggest commodities out there, especially when you're growing any brand, business. A lot of people care about attention. What is everybody focusing on? So right now is kind of like the gold mine. It reminds me of TikTok 2019, right? 2019, 2020, when it was a lot easier to grow. It's not as easy nowadays. I uh, launched a training on like the seven weeks on how I did 100K on TikTok. It was a lot easier back then. Now, as the platform's getting flooded, reminds me of how people are switching over to IG and IG Reels. So let's chat about these few key points. One is the shareable content. Are you making content about yourself, 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 or content that actually drives value, whether it's education or entertainment type of content? These are majority of the content that we see that are shareable. Make your content shareable where people are willing to share it onto their stories. I looked at why I was growing so fast on Instagram, and I looked at it, and you guys can actually go, you click, and you tap in and you can see how many uh, stories are being shared in the last 24 hours of a specific post. And I saw there were so many, I mean, just showing you guys these pictures and these videos around it. I had over 100 plus people share my, store, my, my post on their stories within a 24 hour period. I couldn't see if anyone else shared it before or after. And these are videos that legit, I, I shot two weeks ago dropped three weeks ago. It's such an amazing thing to be able to see when you're creating shareable content, the virality of your brand and people going to your page and je them just seeing it because the content wasn't for me. The content was for the community. The content's for the audience. Make shareable content. Make it less about yourself and more about what you can give to your community. And if you want to be able to check out how to see if people are sharing it, You'll, you'll check there and I, I don't get notifications for this. You have to actually go to each post and check and see if people are sharing it within the 24 hour mark. And this is what allows it to get bumped up into the algorithm on the explore page for IG reels. So more people can see your stuff, make your content shareable Two Instagram stories. If y'all look at Instagram stories, it's a great way to engage with your new followers. And I've noticed here's a little quick hack at the beginning of the day, do this, create a poll right? It could be yes, no, A or B, whatever. And create a, a poll with a any type of story. It could be a picture. It can literally just be you on a camera talking for 10 seconds. I would do anywhere from like an average of two to three minimum pieces of IG stories a day. I wouldn't do like more than 30, right? Because it just gets like where people are just tapping. Get a couple every day, right? A couple reps in. And if you want to increase your engagement, this has actually 2x or even 3x. Sometimes it hit almost you know, over, over a thousand plus people watching my stories at one point. And mind me, I don't have a big viral brand where it literally, when I do that, I I've noticed days, I don't do a poll other days. I do a poll, T test that out, test out the polls, see if that works for you. Cause it's been working across the board. People I've been telling them to, Hey, drop polls and they're getting more people watching their stories. I believe IG and IG stories, they like that. And I believe it just bumps it more. That's a great way to be able to continue to push your brand and get out there. So make sure you guys are posting two to three times minimum on your stories every day. Like I said, simple things. It can just be like, hey, what's up? Good morning. Hey, it's going to be a great day. Or if you also want, make sure you add polls beginning of the day and watch your engagement get 
and increase supernaturally. Number three is consistency. I remember December 1st of 2021, I decided to post at least one IG reel a day. I just saw where the attention was going. And within those four weeks, it was like, it was a slow start. But then after the second and third week, I started getting like 100 people following me like by the hour at one point like my videos were just going viral out there and this like i said is the power of staying consistent commit to at least one post a day and here's what's great you don't have to reinvent the wheel i grew a lot of my following on tiktok and all i do is just repurpose it from tiktok and throw it onto the instagram reels i do the same it's the exact same post so i didn't even create any new content in december on my ig you can go check my ig of all the december posts they were all from my TikTok that I've been building for over two years now. So again, I just stayed consistent, one post a day on IG Reels, and that's what really stacked the momentum. So when you decide to go all out and don't let uh, inconsistency stop you from getting started, get started and start to build a habit. Start to build a habit. You miss one day, it's okay. Post the next day and even post twice if you have time to make up for it. Consistency really builds a lot of momentum. And when you have multiple pieces of viral content going out there, especially during December, it was like a lot of virality for my personal brand. I was able to get a lot of exposure. You guys can actually see I had 400,000 reach with my account just in the month of December. And then in January, we did an extra 300,000. So the reach is just like, phenomenal. So I'm, I'm switching my content strategy. I've really slowed down a little bit with the consistency, but I decided to kind of go out there and experiment with a few new things as I'm ending uh, the 90 day run. And here's a few bonuses I want to be able to share with y'all. Bonus number one, in order to remove the watermark from TikTok. So if you want to use your TikTok and put it on to IG without the watermark, go to snaptick.app, snaptick.app. I was able to use this uh, and it's it's easy. You just copy the link from TikTok, paste it on there, download it, it removes the watermark and you can go ahead and drop it into IG Reels. Super clutch, helps a lot. And it's something that I, I learned just by like doing some quick, quick research. Bonus number two is the ability to go live. If you have the ability to go live with your audience, my Instagram lives have been way more than my TikToks and my TikToks were running a lot. I have 200,000, 240,000 right now on my TikTok and only 19,000 on IG. What I like about IG is the stories, it pumps up everyone that's live to the very left. So everyone that follows you will be able to see you live. So it's just another bonus to be able to build more momentum onto your account. Go live, even if it's saying hi, answering questions, literally just connecting with your community, great way for growth for your account. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and this made sense. Feel free to tap a like, hit the sub if you guys enjoyed this stuff. Any questions, you guys can drop them in the comments or send me a DM on IG. You guys can check out my stuff. I'll be optimizing it this next month. Anyways, y'all be blessed. Again, any questions, drop them in. Take care. Have a great week. Bye-bye.